Well, this turned out to be another day where I didn't get a whole lot done. I was going to can pumpkins today, and I, um, I don't know. Today, I've just been super tired again, and I just decided I didn't want to deal with it today. You know, these pumpkins that I got, they'll, they'll hold off for several weeks, you know. So, nothing I had to get done today. I just thought since I, you know, was off, I would do this and... I don't know, maybe we'll do it again tomorrow, you know, try again tomorrow. But I know I, I have to make a birthday cake tomorrow because Sunday or Saturday is my son's birthday. And today I ended up just chilling most of the day. I got some laundry put away and just did some straightening up around here. And that was it, you know. Um, I honestly didn't realize <laughs> how tired, <coughs> excuse me, how tired I was. I listened to um, a couple of the virtual workshops on hydration. Last week's I was really it was really good to listen to. This week, it, I don't know it doesn't really apply to me because I drink a lot of water anyway, so it's not something I feel like I really need to watch a lot. So. Um, I mean, I listen to what they say. It's interesting to get a different take on what the different leaders are saying. You know, they pretty much have the same thing. But but um, that's what I did this afternoon and uh, just been catching up on some videos because uh, I haven't really watched a lot of YouTube videos lately um, just because I've been so tired. And um, even though I'm not working tomorrow, I'm going to call it an early night tonight because I am, I tell you what, my body is just tired. <laughs> So, um, anyway, let me go ahead and show you what I've had to eat today. And, um, it's not a whole lot because I haven't been hungry. So, um, but enough. You're not seeing what I had for lunch, though. I had some leftover nachos from, um, the other night. And so I heated up that. I didn't track those because I didn't know how to track them. But I can guarantee you those nachos put me over points because they had meat and cheese and beans on it. So, um, I'm just assuming I had all 30 points today and, um, I mean, that's okay. I'm, I'm okay with that. Uh, actually those nachos are really the only fat that I've had to eat today. So I kind of needed that, uh, that, you know, the fat content. So let me go ahead and show you what I had for breakfast and lunch. Believe me, it's nothing too exciting. It's cold, rainy morning out. So I'm just having a quick breakfast bacon egg and cheese bagel um this is the thomas bagel thin three points for that i have it toasted 14 grams of the reduced fat mexican cheese for one point and two points in my um one egg zero points for one slice of canadian bacon so one two three four five six my grapes are zero and then of course i've got my uh, coffee with two points in it with the 40 milliliters of half and half. So I have a total of an eight point breakfast today. All right, for my dinner tonight, I'm just having uh, leftovers from last night. This is the remainder of my butternut squash that I cooked yesterday. Uh, zero points for that. And then the rest of my chicken breast from yesterday, 144 grams. That's three points. And I have that topped with my home canned salsa, which is zero points. So I have a three-point dinner. And as long as the weekly topic is on hydration, I will tell you that this is the third one of these I've had today. So I've had like 96 ounces of water today. Okay, basically it was a leftover day, and I'm okay with that. Uh, tomorrow is going to be another leftover day because I have leftover soup I'm going to be eating. And it's, I mean, it's soup weather anyway. It's cold. <laughs> we, um, we have the air turned off now. And, uh, I, I was out to the mailbox and I thought, gee, this air is getting really chilly and it's been raining off and on all day. It's just going to be, it's been a good day to stay inside and do nothing. So, um, anyway, that's pretty much it for me today. I'm waiting to hear from my daughter. She had a job interview today and so I'm kind of on pins and needles waiting to hear back from here to see how it went. And uh, like I said, I'm going to call it an early night because I'm still really tired. You can probably tell my eyes look tired. Um, and it's a good night since it's so chilly and windy and I don't know. It's a blustery fall day. It's a, it's a, it's a good day 
to go to bed <laughs> and just snuggle up on a blanket. Big day tomorrow. The Hallmark channels start their Christmas 24-7 tomorrow. So, hey, something to look forward to because I love those Christmas movies. Anyway, uh, the Browns play tonight. Not sure. I mean, I probably am not going to even be up for kickoff because I don't think they kick off till 730. So, half their team is injured anyway. But anyway, like I said, that's basically it for me. Uh, I am... I'll see what tomorrow brings as far as whether or not I'm going to work on those pumpkins. Um, I just might wait till next week to do them. So, okay, you guys have a great night, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.